Okay, so this was the first apartment that Cash and I looked at. Um, it's definitely the most modern out of all of the ones that we did look at. Um, I love that it had a huge kitchen. It had tons of storage for all of food and plates and stuff like that. And it had a pantry, which was a plus. And then the living room, the only thing I didn't like was that there wasn't a lot of lighting. Um, and I kind of need lighting for filming, but that's okay. Um, and then this is the bedroom. Had a pretty good sized bedroom. The only thing I didn't like is it had carpet. Had a really good walk-in closet, so that would fit a lot of stuff for me and Cash, which I loved. And I loved the bathroom because it had two sinks, which is so, so awesome. So me and Cash don't have to share and because I have a ton of beauty products. Um, as you can see, I'm super excited. Um, so the bathroom is huge, which was a really good plus. So overall, we really loved this apartment, um, and it was just a really perfect space for our first place together. And also, it has a little patio, which Cash loves, and so do I. So he's going to bring his little grill. Um, so this was one of the choices that we loved um and it actually ended up being the top two it also has a really really awesome gym which is a really big plus so we don't have to pay for a gym membership um this is the best gym that we ever saw in all the apartments so that's a really good plus as well um overall it was a really good place that we saw okay so we just saw two different apart oh not even oh, i thought i wasn't filming oh well you don't know by now how many times <laughs> no there's a little record thing. okay anyway so we just saw two places um sorry the first one we liked better they were literally the same exact thing they're just different layouts but the first one that we liked because they had a patio and that'll be nice in the summer we can do yeah it'll be really nice yeah it'll be really it wasn't like a huge patio but no it was bigger than i mean when people say outdoor living area outdoor space i really think it'd be a huge thing in an apartment yeah but no, um i like the layout of the first one better anyway um yeah and it wasn't like i already i didn't film the second one because i knew that we liked the first one better anyway so when's our next appointment four oh we have a while yeah we'll just go that's right in now. the city right yeah okay so our next appointment is in the city so i'm getting the andrews right now go ahead and go ahead and say what you just said about bathtubs what? what did you just say about bathtubs the, no, well, the, these apartments would be the first one in the bathtub, so Noel doesn't have to worry about bleaching it. <laughs> yeah, I have a weird thing with bathtubs that if someone else used it before me, I have to wear like flip flops in the shower. She wore flip flops in her shower all throughout college in her apartment, <laughs> both of them. It's I I don't I can't take baths. I can't touch the bath. Something weird. So I'm very excited that I'm the first person to touch this tub. <laughs> Okay, so we were supposed to see the place above me. Um, and Cash yeah. talked to the people like a week ago and said, call when we have our appointment. Um, and yeah, we just called, they said they have no availabilities. So we can't look at any apartments. So we're not seeing this one, which is great. So we have two tomorrow. Um, so that's what we're gonna do tomorrow. Farmer, I was kind of looking forward to looking at this one. I know, cool area. Um, yeah, this is right in the city, and that's behind us, but we have two tomorrow, um, and... <laughs> cute! <laughs> so cute! That's disgusting. Um, but I'm really excited about the two that we see tomorrow because they're like a loft-style like brick wall, and those are my favorite. So I'm excited to see those two tomorrow, but I guess we're just gonna go home. Dope. Hey guys, so it's Friday. Um, I am actually waiting to pick up cash. I'm waiting for him outside his work. Just waiting for him to come outside. Um, I did have my interview this morning. Um, I think it went really well. Um, oh my god, I hate interviews so much. Um, I think I did really well. I don't think I could have done any better. So I'm just giving, just waiting and seeing if I got the job or not. Um, and if I do or if I don't, I'm gonna leave it up to God. It's his plan if I get it or not. Um, but fingers crossed. But right now we're looking at two apartments today and hopefully we get to look a little bit more. Um, but I'm just waiting for cash and I see him behind me. Um, he's right there. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go look at apartments and I'm gonna take you guys along with us. So this was the second place that we looked at, um, and this was in the city. This is more my style. I loved the loft style brick wall type feel to this apartment. The windows are so beautiful, um, and I just love the feel of this, how old this apartment is. The only thing I hated was the bedroom because it was open. Um, the flooring was super ugly, and then there, there was this like random door um, that didn't open. Um, but overall, I really liked this apartment. Um, wasn't my favorite. Um, but it was still beautiful. And then this was the sad disgrace of a gym that they had. <laughs> it's terrible. 
Okay, so the rest of the apartments you're going to see in this vlog are all in the same building, which I love this building. This building was my absolute favorite. Um, I loved, again, the old um, style of this building. It was very loft style um, type feel. The kitchen was beautiful. It was massive. Um, the flooring was absolutely beautiful, the wooden flooring. The windows were my favorite part. It just let in so much beautiful natural light. The ceiling was beautiful. Like, everything I could have loved, it was just a beautiful apartment. Um... <clears throat> It also had um, a pretty decent sized bedroom as well. Um, again, it let in so much natural light in this room. It was just, oh my God. This whole building just had beautiful rooms and it was just goals. Again, this one had a washer and dryer in the unit, which is not like a popular thing when it comes to apartments. Um, this is the walk-in closet, which was just, oh, it's beautiful. Um, and then here's the bathroom. Um, it was a little small, um, but again, I mean, the living room and everything was just beautiful. Um, <clears throat> so I loved this building and I loved this unit. Um, so yeah. So this unit in particular was my absolute favorite. This is the one that I really, really, really wanted. It had a guest bathroom. Um, the kitchen was a really nice size. I loved how it was just an open floor plan. Oh, and the windows were my favorite part. This is apartment was my absolute dream this is my dream apartment um again it let in such natural light the floors were beautiful um and the bedroom was massive oh my god the bedroom was just such a great size the only thing with this apartment building is they only had availability for one car so unfortunately we couldn't go with this building because of the fact that we have two cars which sucks because i wanted this place so bad the closet was beautiful had great space and then the bathroom was great again as well but unfortunately, we couldn't go with this one, and I wanted it so bad. So this was the last unit that we saw in this apartment building, and in general, again, it had that same old loft style feel. Um, big kitchen. The only thing is there was a huge, massive pole in the middle of the kitchen, which was kind of stupid, but it was because of the original building plans, and they couldn't move it. Um, this came with a fireplace, which was really cool, and it had, the, again, the same beautiful building um, windows, um, let in a lot of natural light. And then the bedroom was kind of like the same as the other two, um, but again, I, we didn't go with this one because of the fact that the parking and the pole, which would have been a huge, huge annoyance. Hey guys, um, it's been a couple of days since I've talked to you and I was looking at my footage and I realized that, um, me and Cash, uh, we didn't update you all, um, after we saw our last apartment showing. Um, it's beautiful. That place is gorgeous. Um, and we definitely narrowed it down to which one we wanted. Um, and as you guys know, I had a job interview that weekend and it's, I think it's the following weekend if I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Um, so it's been about a week since the whole thing happened. Um, and it's been a little crazy right now. Um, I ended up not getting the job that I initially, um, applied for, but as of right now, we're still trying to figure everything out. And if there's a job available or if not um there are some things that are still going on and still things that are still being talked about so i definitely will update you guys um but it's definitely been crazy so we're just kind of like waiting um if you can look behind if you can look like where i'm looking right now i have like i'm half packed because i'm not sure um if i need to be packed or not so i'm kind of just like in limbo um but we're taking it day by day and i definitely will update you guys on what is happening but for right now we have narrowed down the places that we saw we have found ones that we really like and um now we're just kind of waiting so um i decided to just update you guys um since a i left you hanging after my apartment looking and two it's been about a week and a lot has happened since then um but i'm just remaining optimistic and i believe god has a plan for me and for cash and i and us and i believe everything happens for a reason and he will let us moving together when he feels it is right and the timing is right and everything i just believe will fall into place um so i'm just relying on god and trusting his plan but it's very very difficult um but yeah so i will keep you guys updated um and hopefully things go well <laughs>